So there's still segregation in Salvador, you were saying? Oh, sure. But it's just a piece of history. Become a member of the Brotherhood, you must be a black person. And my understanding is, it's a Catholic church too, Same. and it's black people and white people. Yeah. So why keep the separation in this one here? Who created that separation was the Catholic Church. Wow. Some of the people are buried here, right? Who are these people who are buried here? Is the relationship between black and white people getting better or worse here in Salvador? They were African people. Many of them were from Cameroon. Imagine all these people who were enslaved back then. Pray here. So guys, we are back in Pelourinho with my man Mario here. Mario, thank you so much for the interviews. Guys, we went into the temple for the Candomblé religion. If you haven't seen that video yet, kindly check it out. So we are back downtown here in downtown Pelourinho and we are going to try to show you the inside of this magnificent church. What is the name of this church? That's the Church of Our Lady of the Rosary of the Black People. Okay. She's the, she was the slave protector. She was the slave protector? Yeah. And that's because slaves back then, even though they were building the churches, they were not allowed to go and practice, right? It, it, it was the kind of the, the Portuguese people make different than the, 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 white, the white people church. Yes. Yeah, it's open. All right. So slaves built all the churches you see here in Salvador. All of them, but they were not allowed to practice. So what they decided to do is to build their own. So this is it. That's what they built. Let's go inside. Obrigado, obrigado. <laughs> so we are inside the church now. Guys, I've never been in the church before, but it's just a piece of history. This is where the slaves came to pray. Wow. It's amazing to be in this place that slaves actually built and practice, you know? Yeah. Wow. Currently, any person can attend the Mass of here. Yes. Who are celebrated on Wednesday, okay? Yes. It, what for me is, more, is very interesting that the, uh, the Virgin of Rosary, she is a white woman. She was not a, a black yes. woman. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So, this is a Catholic church, correct? Yeah. Okay. I don't know. So, guys, um, the first thing I will tell you that strikes me between this church and the other ones I've seen is the lack of luxurious items. There are three different churches I visited here, Catholic churches, and they always have these magnificent ornaments, right? But here, obviously, they didn't have the cold. They were shipping gold from Portugal. And here, you have very humble decorations. The crosses are made out of wood. You have the statues. I'm not sure if the mural is original. We're gonna get closer. Let's go take a look. So this is what you have. Just, uh, do you believe this is original? Yes. The mural is? That is. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. The only thing that will strike you is the African features, right? The African features. Look at this. Because it was decorated by slaves, you know, some of these murals are with black faces. Even here, you have Jesus, who looks like a black man, and then the disciples, all black. <laughs> Here, look at this statue, guys. Look at this one. All black as well. This is an angel. Santo Elisbao. Alright, that's a saint. That's a saint. And another thing you would normally have is just the grand gold on the ceiling. And here, guys, check this out. Look. This is just, it's beautiful, it's large, but it's certainly not bright and gold. Which, again, makes sense. They had simple means. But this is still, you can imagine all these people who were enslaved back then, praying here. This is 
This is amazing. I really like the black things. Yeah. It's uh, it's amazing. Yeah. And then you have tile floor in here. Wow. Look at this. This is Santa Evigenia. So Santa Evigenia came, came from Angola. She came from Angola. Yeah. Okay. And San Benedito San came Benedito. from Mozambique. He came from Mozambique. Yeah. All right. So guys, Angola and Mozambique. Now, what's striking? The saint is black, but the baby being held is white. That's, that's interesting. It looks like some of the people are buried here, right? Yeah. Because it's very common in the Catholic Church to yes. bury their the pastors people. and priests. I mean, the yeah. priests, I should say, inside the church. So this individual here, Restos Mostales, Mortais, Mortais. Mortais. Isabel Maria de Santana. She uh, is resting since uh, 1894. Okay. And this one is 1832. Wow, and because of the heat, this intense heat, you got silly fans over here. So, Caesar. what's what's your Sorry, name? Teacher. And not Julius Caesar. Julius Caesar. Julius Caesar. And the lady, her name is Marinalva Rodrigues. Marinalva Rodrigues. Okay. A queridinha do vale. All right, all right. Jazer Maria. So, who are these people who are buried here? Quem são essas pessoas mesmo enterradas aqui? São africanos. They were African people. Yes. And many of them were from Cameroon. How, how random? Cameroon, Angola. Angola, also. Wow. Congo. 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 Eh, how do Nigeria. 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 Benin. 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 Mm -hmm. Wow. Are they, were they enslaved people? Foram pessoas que foram escravizadas. Isso. E foram membros dessa irmandade. And they were members of that uh, brotherhood. Okay. All right. Que ajudaram na construção do And they helped to build this building. This building. Okay. Yeah. How about how about the people in the cemetery that we're about to go see? As pessoas que estão no cemitério, quem são elas? As pessoas que estão no cemitério Sim. são foram membros daqui. Tá falando do cemitério lá fora. Isso. Ali são foram duas pessoas que foram enterradas porque já estava sendo proibido os enterros nas igrejas. Okay. Né? E essas pessoas eram parentes de alguém daqui da Irmandade, morreram de inanição okay. no centro histórico e foram enterradas ali. Ok, e eles foram morreram lá porque nesse lugar eles foram overcrowded. Eles não tinham mais espaço ainda. Sim, eles tinham pessoas que foram morreram lá fora. Então aqui é a Terra Sagrada. Aqui. Sim. Uma mulher muito importante da nação Grunsis. She was a very important woman from the nation Brunis, from Ghana. From Ghana, yes. lady from Ghana. Okay. So were they members of the church or were they pastors? I mean, a priest in this case. Eles eram só membros ou eles eram líderes da comunidade? Líderes da comunidade, porque aqui tinha uma tem uma irmandade onde esses homens e mulheres faziam parte, administravam o templo e ajudavam na libertação de outros membros e ajudavam aqueles que se tornavam livres a começar uma nova vida ah. emprestando dinheiro. Ok, they were leaders, ok, yes. and they helped the uh, slaves who were set free. Yes. Ok, to socialize again between the community. Ok. Ok. Mm -hmm. Sounds good. So, is the church still a predominantly black church or is it more mixed today? In, nos dias de hoje, ela é predominantemente negra ou ela aceita qualquer pessoa frequentar como irmão? Não, como membro da irmandade tem que ser negro ou seus descendentes. Ok, for you become a member of the brotherhood, you must be a black person. You must be black. Be black, ok? But this is a Catholic church, right? <laughs> é, mas é uma igreja católica, né? Sim. Como pode? Como pode? Uh -huh. Foi a Igreja Católica quem criou isso mesmo, essa separação de... Who created that separation was the Catholic Church. Wow. <laughs> They didn't create anything. In 1685, yes, foi criada a Irmandade 
de Nossa Senhora do Rosário dos Homens Pretos. It was created the community of Our Lady of Rosary of the Black People. Yes, but I went to the church of Bonfim, mm -hmm. and my understanding is it's a Catholic church too, Sim. and it's black people and white people. Yeah. So why keep the separation in this one here? Ah, ele disse que também ouviu falar isso sobre a igreja do Bonfim, que ela foi uma igreja só para negros. Não. Não. A igreja do Bonfim foi criada por um é, por um navegador português. Ah, uma promessa que ele fez. For a, a, navig a Portuguese navigator, uh, uh, it was his promise. Yeah. E ela é predominantemente branca. She is predominant. She is predominant uh, white. Yeah. Em okay. toda a cidade, no centro in the histórico, in the in center, yes. as irmandades yeah. eram de brancos, yes. were of white people, yes. negros Black. e pardos. And mixed. And mixed. Ok. E hoje... Eu sou mixado. Então, ainda é separado lá? Ainda é essa separação hoje em dia? Sim. Realmente? Yes. Nós sofremos preconceitos Until today we suffering practice Por manter center. vivas as nossas to tradições our africanas African. nas celebrações das missas. In the celebrations of the masses. Okay. The wow. people has a, there are a, a, there is a great resistance. So there's still segregation in Salvador, you were saying. Você quer dizer que aqui ainda existe segregação? For sure. For sure. Are things getting better or worse? Você acha que isso é legal ainda ou... Isso é um crime, né? Mas as pessoas ainda praticam, né? But the people practice as well. Yeah. But is the relationship between black and white people getting better or worse here in Salvador? Atualmente, vamos dizer assim, a relação entre negros e brancos, a questão de comunidade, ela é boa ou ela é ruim? Comunidade religiosa, católica? Sim. Ela é... não é? Ela... Mantém as aparências, vamos dizer assim. Uh, they keep the appearance, but in, in the deep... It's not the case. It's not the case, yeah. Do they get paid the same if they go... If you say a black person gets a job and then a white person gets the same job, would they get paid the same? Or is there still discrimination on the payment as well? Okay. And I see you smiling already, so I think I get the answer, but let me hear this. Okay. So, ele quer saber se hoje pessoas negras têm salários menores do que os brancos. Absolutely. So they get paid less? Na escala, na escala, o homem branco tem um maior salário, depois a mulher branca, depois o homem negro, depois a mulher negra. In the mentoring, the white man yes. get the high salary after that, the voice. Depois do, é, do homem branco, a mulher branca the, uh, tem os melhores women, salários. The white women. Yes. Aí depois vem o homem negro. After that, the black man. E a mulher negra vem... Por último. In the last, in the last place, the black women. Okay. You have any questions? Um, are there any similarities to, are there any links to baptism, or uh, like the Baptist Church at all? Existe algum tipo de ritual diferente da Igreja Nossa Senhora dos Negros dos Negros das outras igrejas católicas? Os toques, a música, a dança. Okay, only the rhythms. The, the, the rhythm, rhythm. The rhythm. Yeah. ritmos africanos they use the they keep in, in dança. playing yes. the, the music the this, uh, the dance yes dança africana e a comida and também and the, and food, I need the food as well the black eyed peas vatapá caruru feijoada okay is there a movement to trace the history the dna to africa like does he know what part of africa his ancestors came from Ok, você sabe de que parte de seus ancestrais foram da África? Eu não sei, é, se per nos perdemos assim, mas através da religião a gente consegue identificar mais ou menos de que procedência nós viemos da África. Ok, ele não sabe exatamente. Ele não sabe. O candomblé. Ele não sabe exatamente, mas ele disse que, através do fruto do candomblé, ele faz algumas pesquisas, ok? Ele tem uma noção disso. Ok. Uma pequena noção. E de onde mais ou menos você acha que... Ele tem uma noção disso. É, ultimamente, né, eu, eu descobri Italy, que provavelmente a minha probably descendência vem da região da África Ocidental, Nigéria, Nigéria e Benin. Ok. Por conta de um espírito que veio e falou 
que ele, no passado, os meus parentes eram parentes dele. Ah, ele disse que o espírito, ok? Sim. Yes. Ok, incorporate yes. in a person. Yeah. Said his ancestors came from Benin, Nigeria. Não Benin, incorporados. Nigeria. O espírito veio mesmo. Ah, he com saw, roupas he said he saw Os gegunguns. Got dressed with African clothes. Oh, wow. Gegunguns. Ok. Yes. Egungun. Egungun. Egungun, the name of the spirit. Ok. Now, what does he think about Candomblé? O que você acha sobre Candomblé? Porque nós vimos de um terreiro agora, né? Minha raiz, minha herança. His, his root, his uh, territory. A heritage. So his 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 family practices Candomblé. Seus so, so, seus familiares em Candomblé país. Okay. Yes. Eu sou um praticante do Candomblé. No, he is adapted from the Candomblé. No. Can e the, membro dessa irmandade. A member of this brotherhood. Can the white person join the Candomblé religion? <laughs> é, eu quero saber na sua opinião porque todo isso já foi respondido agora há pouco, né? Como é que se faz para se tornar um Candomblécista? Que não é o seu caso que você já nasceu. É... Nós temos, todos um de nós, temos um orixá. Yeah, yeah, he told about the orixá. Ou um vodum. Yes. Uh -huh. Ou um vodum. Uh -huh. Ou um ikisse. Ikis. Ok. Uh -huh. Que vai dizer, não é? Uh -huh. Vai chamar a gente a uh -huh. prática do religião do candomblé. Ok. The orixá will adopt any person. Ok, said that you are mine, ok? And that, that's why he was called by, qual foi o seu orixá? Orishasi. Yes. Was the Orisha who called casa. him? Okay. The hunt, the hunting man. So my last question. Uh, Thank you so much. My last question. <laughs> Somebody is gonna watch this video mm -hmm. and say, "Oh, black people don't allow white people to come in the church. It's 2023. Why can white people come and pray here?" And they will say it's discrimination. What does he say about that? Ele diz que assim, isso não seria uma discriminação reversa se você não aceitar as pessoas brancas se tornarem membro da comunidade? Acredito que você mas já tem, não tem brancos na né, comunidade, mas não na irmandade, na ordem tem sido nosso senhor do Rosário dos Pretos. Ok. He said tem the, outras devoções. Any person from any race can attend the mass, okay? okay. But they can, can, can they cannot uh, make part of the brotherhood. They cannot join the, the brotherhood. Yeah. Okay. All right. Sounds good. I understand now. Okay. So they can come and pray. No problem. Okay. Okay, good. Thanks for the clarification. Okay. All right. Thank you so much, man. Thank Appreciate you. you. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Obrigado. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So we're going to continue this journey on the cemetery. All right. So let's go. Where's the cemetery? Right there? All right. All right. So guys, now I'm gonna show you the cemetery that has been here for, since the creation of this church actually, it has been here. So you, what you have here is, uh, you know, candles that you can lit up for the prayers. It's right there. And I want you to pay a close attention to this beautiful artifact. Oh my God, I was wondering where the cemetery was, guys. And I'm walking on it. Wow, so this is the hallowed ground. This is the cemetery right here. Yeah. There are wow, only two people. Only two people. Here, yeah. Okay, wow, I was wondering where the cemetery was and well, I'm right this there. This was the Queen Anastasia. Queen Anastasia, tell she, me about Queen Anastasia. Queen Anastasia, she was like an activist, okay? She okay. was a slave queen. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So she was muted by the lords. Oh, she was muted. Okay. Yeah. That's why she's wearing that mask on her face mm -hmm. right there. Okay. Uh, there are many for her memory. Yes. All right. Sounds good. And then, um, so there are people buried here. And then in the back there, this is uh, just a normal yeah, people the residences, right? Yeah. 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 Okay. That is, that is the famous Baixa dos Sapateiros. Yeah. That was a community for people who uh, created shoes. Okay. The, uh, the shoe, shoe is factor. Shoemakers. Yeah, shoemakers. Yeah. Okay. All right. And until today, the name of this neighborhood is Baixa do Sapateiro. Baixa do Sapateiro. Is Baixa comes the uh, low neighborhood. Yes. And Sapateiros, shoemakers. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Wow. So guys, this is what you have here. This is the view from here. 
just right next to the church you have these residences we are in Pelerino not too far from the fa famous area where Michael Jackson filmed the video clip they don't care about us and this is where this church is located and it's been there you have to wonder if that's why he strategically picked that area right so that's what you have over here it's just a normal neighborhood and most people that live in this area here are blind all right and they usually live in the poorest part of the city homes are stuck together here the term favela is no use you will talk about this place as a community you do not say favela in salvador all right guys cool room. and this is the final room i'm going to show you on this tour yes. so this is where the all that is santa barbara santa barbara okay she was a warrior okay she was uh, by the people of the candomblé her name is yansa yeah she is very common okay yeah. worship in the candomblé yes all right sounds good all right so guys this is the different saints that you have here and again i feel bad stepping on these you know tomb, tombs over here and uh, you have all the different uh you know saints and this is basically all black saints right here you know yeah that's what you have all right these are all black saints yeah oh man what's interesting they all have white babies yeah this is jesus Okay. Who is Jesus? Represent Jesus, Jesus Christ. Okay. That represent Jesus. Okay. Jesus. Okay. okay. Sounds the boy good. Jesus. The boy Jesus. Okay. That one is a gypsy. That one is a gypsy. Or that's a madam. Okay. Madam Lulu. Madam Lulu. Yeah. Okay. It's a gypsy. She was a gypsy. Okay. And then you have this lady here. This is my mini Mia. My mini Mia. My mini Mia. Mini Mia means uh, little girl. A little girl. Okay. Little girl. Okay. She was one of the high priestess of the Candomblé. Oh. Yeah. Okay. She is, is, is a very well-known uh, well person here. Well known. It's been okay. a pleasure. Thank you again to Mario for all your assistance. Without this man, it would not be possible. If somebody watches this video and say, Man, Mario, you are so interesting. I want to get a hold of you. How can they contact you? Okay. You can uh, uh, find me out in my Instagram, Mario MSCs, okay? And I'm creating a company. The name is Nightlife Guides, okay? Where I take foreign people to the nightlife here yes. in Salvador. Okay. Do you have your phone? I want to flash your Instagram. Okay. So, guys, the Instagram is uh, Mario Masses. Mario M. Assis. Mario M. Assis. Yeah. And you can help them whether they are looking for, you know, recommendations where to go or they're just bored at night and they need to have some fun. So guys, hey, thank you, Mario. I appreciate right your time, on. man. What do you think about this, Gary? The church? The church and the whole experience with this guy right here. First off, uh, it was amazing. It was great to meet you. I was happy that we met. And um, I think Mario's a fantastic guy. And, uh, you know, he knows a lot about the history. Yes. And, you know, he's one of the best people I think we've met yes. in Salvador in I terms agree. of knowing the city yes. of Salvador. Because it's yes. a very... Um, intimidating place yes. sometimes, yes. you know, it's it's not easy to figure out Salvador and he I knows a lot, so. I agree. All right. Nice one. Well, guys, thank you so much. And if it's your first time on the channel, please kindly give this video a like, press that subscribe button, and from the beautiful city of Salvador, I will see you on the next video. <laughs>